today is am I too old to be wearing stuff like this or is it still fit do not quit it those answers are more coming right up <laughs> hi guys welcome to my channel if you're new thank you so much for joining me and do subscribe as usual I am revisiting my wardrobe to see what fitted pre-COVID-19 and post-COVID-19. As you guys know, on this channel, sustainability matters. We thrift, we repair, we upcycle, we recycle as best as we possibly can. So this video is a visit to my wardrobe to see what I could fit, what, what I should reconsider wearing now that I'm getting older should I still be fronting the same styles should I still be rocking the same high waisted pants and cropped tops should I be doing this now that I'm really really getting older I don't know but to each their own if I love a style I'm gonna keep on wearing it as long as I think it's tasteful, it's chic and sophisticated. That's what my channel is all about. To often reuse, rewear as much as you possibly can. Beyond 30 wears. As you've seen in some of my past videos, I've had pieces for over 20 years and some that I took from my mom or my dad. So they're over 50 or 60 years old. So yes guys that's how we do it on here so prior lockdown this is how i styled this high-waisted pants i love these pants if you guys have been with me from the onset high-waisted pants they are one of my favorite go-to styles i have several pieces in my wardrobe and I often style them with tops like this. This top is a piece I got ages ago and it's a crop top. But of course, I am thinking, should I still be wearing this top? <laughs> That's the key question. The pants, of course, is 100% polyester. You guys know, when it comes to polyester, my issues with polyester and of course the shoe this shoe is also I believe made from synthetic items because I bought it too small and it never stretched so that's a good indication for me but the overall indication is that these are all made of synthetic or polyester items and it's one of the most common fabric in the fast fashion industry and these are the symptoms of polyester and it's not pretty but i continue to wear this piece because as promised i've stated a million times i would be wearing my polyester items to death i love this style and i absolutely love the color and my size when I got this item. The bag is 100% leather. You guys know the drill when it comes to leather. And just in case you don't know, here are some sustainable tips that you should consider when buying leather. Oh my God, I love this outfit and the interesting thing that i just discovered it was made in canada yay because anything that is made locally definitely reduces the carbon and environmental footprint so i love that sorry to interrupt guys but just a quick note hi guys if you just so happen to just click on my video you are new please click the red subscribe button so here they are guys if you click on these buttons you'll be part of my channel and you'll be notified when i post new videos and most importantly guys it's free thank you so much for subscribing love ya let's get back to the video 
So post lockdown, I could barely get this zipper up, guys. Yeah, and I wasn't too very happy about it. <laughs> but I have taken it in stride. I do love some extra punks, but not too much so that my wardrobe doesn't fit. And I love this pants and I want it to fit. So these are my weapons, guys. <laughs> Just grab yourself some penny holes and a body shaper. So if you're one of those that believe that you should not be showing your arms or you should not be showing your decolletage at a certain age, then definitely this look is for you. Most times when you wear high-waisted pants, they do demand a shorter crop top or a cropped jacket. A cropped jacket is a great alternative. So one of the ways I love wearing my blazers is to wear it backwards and Oh my god it just gives it a different look and yes this is a little bit too snug to really show you the effect but I think you have a general idea of how great and elegant and chic it really really looks so I love that and of course here is my post lockdown belly and my pre lockdown belly I can't help but keep comparing it but we are going along with this weight gain, you know. On here, you need to enjoy your perfect imperfections. And of course, as I've mentioned before, wear your blazer backwards. It really up the blazer look a bit. It up your style game a bit. Well, at least in my experience, because I've been doing it for ages and I always get complimented on it. A second option of course is to just wear it as it is and so I'm just gonna shut up apart from the fact that yes this blazer is also a little bit snug and at the same time I didn't want to add any extra bulk by adding a cami underneath so I'm just trying to just hold on to some of my modesty by just kind of blocking it a bit so I know you understand but yeah a really really great look for your high-waisted pants option number three oh my god if you're not scared or if you don't care or if you just just don't want to abandon the sexy cropped decolletage clavicle showing kind of tops this is the one for you because this is very elegant in my opinion it's you can wear it on the shoulder for a cute demure look as well as just hike it down when it gets too hot for that off the shoulder clavicle showing collarbone popping kind of look Another way I love to do this guys is to wear my jewelry pieces at the back and the reason for doing so is that it doesn't detract from the clavicle action from the collarbone vibes that this top demands because as I've mentioned before the collarbone is one of the sexiest parts of the body especially when you are getting older and you don't want to show your legs if you don't have great legs absolutely opt for wearing your jewelry at the back and embrace your collarbone i absolutely love this look it just gives you that element of surprise at the back it's like oh okay this doesn't look too bad and it's definitely a look for me so I love it so embrace your collarbones guys show your 
clavicle and just enjoy the high-waisted style as you move and progress from one age to the next I'm definitely not giving it up just yet and there you go post lockdown and after lockdown I am still enjoying the high-waisted style along with the crop top I hope you learned something Thank you so much for watching and remember to always love yourself, accept your perfect imperfections because they are what make you unique and drop dead gorgeous. Love you and I'll see you in the next one. Take care guys. Bye bye.